All right, I told you guys I would redo it again and I would make it better and I am gonna do just that Welcome back guys. It is your boy T pro and today We are here in CDT and today we are going to be going over the top 10 best Wide body kit slash body kit in a CDT But before we do that be sure to smash that thumbs up button Subscribe if you guys haven't and don't forget to click that post notification bell Like I said, sorry again for that mistake guys. I did not know what happened there. All right, let's go ahead ahead and start with the number 10 on the list i believe this one is still the same and it is the mk5 supra guys this one has a pretty cool wide body kit along with some extra stuff like a front splitter guys but it seems like they did a stock rear diffuser which is kind of disappointing but you can see how beefy this looks right in the front i really like how this one turned out and you guys can see right over here which is the regular mk5 guys you can see how regular it looks and it doesn't really have the wide body kit to it and it made the top 10 list guys because it also has has an interior so this one right here is the first one to kick off the list now the next one guys is actually super unique to the point that we got fans in the back guys this is the bmw s3 or the m3 guys and you can see how much stuff they added to it we got this wide body kit going on and it looks very very blocky which i really really like gives it that retro look and then we got with the retro headlights and then we got the two fans in the back just like the uh pro cards in here and you guys can see there is an interior but the only disappointing thing guys is there is no carbon fiber but this is the s3 right here guys or the m3 and then you guys are gonna go ahead and look at the regular one without the body kit right right here you guys can see the major difference it has number eight on the list guys is the brand new c8 now i really like this one because it looks exactly like the brand new z07 but without the wing and you guys can see it has a pretty unique wide body kit to it you can kind of see the front wheels which is very very cool i've not seen that much around with cars guys and you can see that it does have a wide body kit on the back too only unfortunate thing does not have an interior and as you guys see this is the stock version right over here there is no wide body kit and there is no carbon fiber the only thing i really don't like about this is the fact that it doesn't have a really different hood to it if they had a blacked out hood or roof scoops or something like that with this i think that would have been perfect guys but this is number eight on the list all right, number seven from the list, guys, literally comes from Transformers itself. You guys can see this is the Chevy Camaro, and it has one of the sickest body kits in a CDT. Nobody can tell me any different, guys. You can see how cool the front splitter is connected to the grill with the four canards in the front, guys. And also, we got this cool hood, and of course, we got the big wing in the back. And you guys can see the rear diffuser is absolutely cool. Look how differently that diffuser is than most cars are and yes guys it is a quad exhaust too this is a very very beautiful car and i'm gonna show you guys right now what the car looks like without a body kit so you can see how plain it looks i mean we still have the hood guys but you can see that we don't have any of the cool body kits on it all right this next body kit guys is an absolute beast and it is the porsche taycan guys look at this it does not even look like an electric car anymore and yes i called it slow even though they're like the fastest things in the world but this has a pretty cool body kit you guys can see we have these kind of canards but it's more for airflow right there guys and you can see that we have that cool wing in the back and a wide body kit along with it and i absolutely love this just because it looks totally different from the actual original car guys and i'm gonna show you right here as i'm driving it how it looks like because look at this it looks just like a regular taycan now and you guys it's boring so this is why this is number six on the list guys it is pretty cool i absolutely love it and i didn't think they would go all out on the taycan now if you guys don't know what this car is that's because this is an ordinary looking car and it now looks like this this is the polar star guys and look how amazing they did with this body kit we have canards for days we have a huge splitter in the front or front lip and you guys can see this rear diffuser in the back 
is just absolutely crazy. On top of that, they added a wide body kit, a cool hood, and they added these like black accents on the side of our hood, guys. There's a lot going on on this car. And if you guys want to see how the original looks, this is how the original looks, guys. Plain, and it looks like a Honda Accord. But now, if we want it to look like Megatron that reincarnated, well, look at that guys this is absolutely amazing number five in the list the polar star now i gotta say it is actually fast if you upgrade it guys which is a plus and you guys can see it has an interior it's not the best it is a regular car still guys but the body kit is just out of this world it almost looks like something from liberty walk number four in our list guys is this ford gt and now absolutely wild that we have a supercar that has a body kit guys and on top of that it's a wide body kit you guys can see the bolts are still exposed but it looks so cool we got this stripe going down the middle and we also got a carbon fiber rear diffuser side skirt and a front lip and it's absolutely humongous guys and if you guys want to check this car out with no body kit you guys can see it is absolutely plain jane there's nothing on it i mean we still get the cool hood but other than that there's no wide body kit or there is no huge front splitter now i just wish this would be a little bit faster now this is a little bit controversial but this is number three on our list guys of top 10 best body kits you guys can see we got this ferrari 488 and it's absolutely massive front lip side skirt and you guys can see it has a same crazy diffuser almost like the camaro you guys can see there's no wing to it it just has that duck lip wing but you can add one to it if you wanted to which is the coolest part and you guys can see how it looks like without a body kit it is absolutely plain there's nothing on it but once you slap it on you kind of get the same exact body kit as the ford gt guys and it's super beautiful that's why it is number three on the list and it's a ferrari guys and it also has an amazing interior now number two on the list guys this was actually a very hard one to pick from the top one and the top two and it is the mclaren 720s look how different this car looks from the original guys and it is absolutely amazing you guys can see we got this wide body kit right here on the back and we have this crazy hood and amazing rear diffusers right here they kind of look like two c's or half of a circle guys and it just looks amazing the canard actually makes it look a lot better i'm trying to race here and try to show you guys at the same time and the hood is completely different from the actual one now i like the fact that they still added the black accents on the hood like the real car and you can see that we have an interior guy so this is clearly top two and we did have a fixed spoiler guys but this time we actually have a stock retractable spoiler which actually looks a little bit better now also the reason why this is top two it is such a great performance car you can take this to the track and destroy absolutely everybody with style now this last pick guys was very hard and honestly if that car was still here guys and i am talking about the lamborghini super trofeo it would have won number one but other than that we have the liberty walk nissan gtr right over here guys it is absolutely beautiful and it has a roll cage too not just that it actually has every racing attributes it has we have the window right over here we have no passenger seat we have every carbon we can think of on this car that's why i picked it as number one we got a carbon hood we got a carbon window and a carbon side skirt and on top of that we got these amazing canards in the front with a huge front lip and a carbon fiber grill guys this is overkill this is all out probably one of the coolest and the lightest and it also has a body kit guys now i know this isn't the one with a body kit in the game but this is the nissan rtr rt3 it's still almost the same exact thing 
but it is on a different level itself they do have the re regular one right over here which still looks very very nice in my opinion guys but the rtr is still a body kit and it is number one for my list but thank you guys so much for watching hope you guys enjoyed this video and i hope you guys can hear my voice this time and i love you guys so much for always sticking around thank you guys so much leave in the comments down below what other videos would you guys like to see would you guys like to see a top 10 slowest car in cdt or top 10 ugliest car in CDT. Name a couple of stuff for me in the comments down below. And I will do those videos. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope to see you guys in the next video. And peace out.